and went boom. Oh my god. Damn that Tessa! She's giving me this mission, give me this task to do twice, and twice I've just blown her. It's empty, what is going on? Why is it empty? There's no one here. So I'm just gonna just I'm just gonna take the hornet because the hornet as I said the hornet's hornet's been working well for us, so I'm not gonna say anything about it not crashing for the last twenty minutes, although I just did. But oh my god, is it you know it's I it's amazing. This is just for what it is, I mean, for such an um, an early release of the 2.0, the large, the large like world map, it's you know, it's, it's far ex far surpassed what I expected. Yeah, there was a hot fix patch early, a bit earlier on, um, Sferabum. There was a hot fix patch about three hours ago. Um, Wait, it was number two, wasn't it? And look, the unidentified signal is still there, so we can go back to it once it... Fuck. I... I can't remember. It was two, I think. I don't remember. What is it about with me? Thank you. Oh man, my memory... My, my, that's because I'm old. But look, we can go straight there, right? The signal is still there. We can go and do it. I guess we still have the mission then, because we, you know, we we just um, um, blew up and came back. So I don't know. I mean, well, um, as I said, there has been a hot fix patch, but I have been we've been here for the last like five and a half hours, and it has been crashing a lot. It's here, I just can't get into it. So yeah, this is number three. I just won't let me in. Do another lap. Cause I wanna go to the antenna of my signal and see what it is. We gotta check it out. We gotta check it out, man. I'm surprised there's no No, each time we've spawned, you know, we've, we've crashed a lot. Um but each time we've 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 come back here into the, the station, there's been so many ships here. And but now, if you look, there's landing gear raised. I mean, there's no one here. There's, there's a ship over there. But Pig Mother. Wonderful name. Let's go to the under 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 signal. What pops up? Yeah, it's looking a lot better now. I mean, this 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 particular time is it's, we've been up for a while before since it last crashed, and we've you know we've got a mission. We're traveling. Travel complete. Oh, there's an asteroid field. So what are we actually looking for here? Unidentified signal. Where are you? What they changed the um, free look um, keys to? Dear it! Did anyone remember um, what they changed the free look key to? Rough, so I haven't got to run into the options to look for it, so I can look around. It used to be like control and tab. But they changed it. I remember reading in the patch notes that they changed it, but I forgot what it was because I've never used it. Because I can't target nothing. Starting repairs uh, now. What? Left alt. Ah, okay. Thank you, Luke. So, they're starting repairs. Who is starting repairs? <laughs> I don't know. So, okay, so we're, um... We came here because there's a distress signal, right? But... I mean, I can't... I can't... I can't, um... Target anything. I don't see anything. Are we gonna get jumped or something? We just 
poodle around for a little bit. Now let me just check the Moby guy, see what it's at. Look at it and identify the signal. Okay. Vash one, thank you to follow. Are we just looking around in this area for a signal? Maybe if we get close to it, it will start pinging or something. But yes, Admiral Akbar, yes, definitely. I mean, for all we know, this could be like a, this could be like a home of an asteroid hangar. In, in these big rocks, there could be some pirates having, having a base, you know. What is that? What did I do? Oh, okay. Double click. I. We're having a wonderful time, but I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. I'm not even sure if I went to the right. I don't think this is even the right place. It was the only place I could I, I actually identify it. It was um Let me just double check. So that was the way the probe was. Crusader. Comrades, comrades. Aha, look. What is that? No, that's the one. That's it. That is it. Look at the UEE 649. That is it. Let's go. 9,000 meters. Let's do this. We got it targeted at least. So this is this is what we're looking for. And it's um, 8,000 meters away. And we're closing in. So as we get a bit closer, we'll see it. So as we get a bit, as we get, um, you know, to a few hundred meters, we'll turn the um, this interface off and we will check it out. We got it, we got it. Oh, is it? Oh. At least that's the, that's the center of the area we are. So there's a red flashing beacon we're looking for, a red flashing light. That's going to be um, a bit of a challenge, isn't it? Looking for a red flashing light in an asteroid field. So you say turn on your AR. I'm not sure what you mean by it, that Nalakondra. But yeah, I guess I guess Luke, um, you're saying the audio's not working. If the audio's, audio's working, we'd probably get some sort of um, audio clues, like you'd, you'd hear the distress beacon, I guess. I guess is, is that what's supposed to happen? You'll hear like the um, audio from the distress beacon. Is a one okay? So it's it's close to some ship debris. I haven't seen any ship debris. Oh, I've not seen any ship debris. It's a big place. But yeah, I mean, I, there's nothing I can. I've not seen anything on the radar, and I've not um, seen any any targets. If I can target at all. But it's not crashing. Isn't that isn't that good? It's not crashing. 
Så efter, efter, ja, efter nu. Kørende rundt. Øy. It's a shame you can't leave a trail behind you to see where you've been, so you don't get run in, um, in circles. We need like a telescope. Retrovex music. Think of the following. We need like a telescope. That's what we. That's what we could really use. A telescope or something, so we can actually see, have a look around. Everything looks the same, it all looks like just rocks. Because it is just rocks. Now, this asteroid is big. Close up on a larger asteroid? What do you mean, like this one? So this is obviously um, one of the bigger ones. Um, a Cerebon. And that, that was, I was going to max, I think it's only like, um, it was max speed in um, SCM mode, which is the normal, the normal um, drive mode for the, it's the normal, new flight mode, it's the same as what we have in the 1.2, 1.3. It does look good, doesn't it? Asteroids have, have come on a long way. So yeah, so it's only only doing like two hundred uh, meters per second in the Hornet. It's not it's not the quickest of ship. This makes me wonder now. Maybe I should have brought like a three fifty or something that was quicker. So yeah, this is SCM mode. In cruise mode, you can actually go up to like nine hundred and forty five um, meters per second. But you have, you can't, you don't really have any. Um, your maneuvering is really limited. I press. Oh shit! Oh yeah, yeah. To go to cruise mode, yeah. So you can go into up to nine hundred and forty-five in cruise mode. Um, but your your navigation, you can't um, move around quite as freely. So. You gotta drop it out of um, drop it back into SCM to actually be able to um, <laughs> manipulate your ship. But you can get it. It's definitely a good way of you getting some nice little speed boosts, though, isn't it? Just switch it in there and get the speed up, and when you drop it out, it just slowly tr slow down. Yeah, yeah, V is toggling cruise mode and uh, the flight modes. So if I hit V, it uh, goes, you know, it toggles into cruise mode. Um, as it says there, it takes 10 seconds to get to maximum speed, and maximum speed is like 945. But as you see, like, the maneuverability is really, is really um, limited like this. So it's good from getting to like one, one side of this field to the other, but... Um, if you need to maneuver quickly to stop avoid hitting an asteroid, um, it might take a little while. I don't see this, damn it! Shouldn't you use your ambient sensor in the bottom right? I. But the thing is, I mean, that's. I don't... I don't think so, I don't know. I actually don't know. I mean, it's the first time we've got as far as doing, you know, doing something like this in a mission, because it was, it was... it was pretty crash prone earlier, and we was just messing around because of how much it was bombing out. I'm trying to find a distress signal, so we come to a location... We was given a um, location for it where there's a distress beacon, and we're coming to find out what it is. Um, 
you got the email, but your stress is... I've not crashed for quite a while now. It's, I mean, I've been crashing quite frequently today, but um, this this time here when I've logged in, it's been up, it's been up for quite a while. We, I'm probably getting close to like half an hour, I think, before, since I've last crashed. But I, I don't know where it is. I think Luke in chat was saying that um, it's supposed to... Yeah, so Luke says, like, I would skip this one, it's only a light. Many more action pack missions out there. It's the first one I got. It's, it's just because I was I went to this place and this one this Tesla come over the the um came over the, the kind of the comms and told us to go look at this beacon. So we went a little look. But but Luke was saying in chat a bit earlier that it's supposed to be, it's, the sound is bugged just um at the moment. So it's probably it's probably supposed to be easier than this. Um maybe the maybe the sound from the beacon is supposed to give an indication where it is or something. But but if it's if it's a little bit um. Yeah, if it's just a little flashing light and stuff. Yeah, I mean, we 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 went to one um, distress or one um, calm array, and when we went to the calm array, it actually highlighted a couple more markers on the map, and one of them was their probe. And when we went to the probe, it gave us a mission. I mean, we do have another mission to actually go and um, turn on more probes. So we're gonna, we'll go and actually turn on another one. We'll we'll go to another another one and turn it on. I don't know if I should. At what point I should start worrying about actually getting fuel, about my ship running out of fuel or anything. Let's go to. I don't know. This I don't even know which one I went to the first time. Let's go that one. Bottom travel initiated. Comrade two four five. Let's check this one out. Check out two seven five. Travel complete. Bogey scanning. Yes, this yes, not over. Scanning. You got the situation handled. See, that's what I said last time. I said we got the situation handled, so I didn't even bother trying to attack anyone. I just thought, screw it, I'll let them deal with it. And what happened? I was getting attacked. I feel it's in the middle of the screen. I'll, I'll, we'll take a look and we'll have a look. And thank you, Luke. It's good. Always, it's definitely good to see you guys hanging out in um, in um, streams, especially uh, on a day like today when everyone's everyone's like trying this out. Yeah, we got this in. We're trying it out, and it's all very, very new to us. I mean, uh, I very this this part here where you're going into the, the comrade. We watched the. I was at Citizen Car. We watched the watched it on the, the big screen. Oh my god! And it's like, oh my god! I can't wait to do that. And here we are. You know, here we are. It's just less than two months later. Here we are. Wait, no. Player. There's a pirate in an M50. What? Locked. Really? Bogey. Bogey. He's got an M50. You're kidding. Locked. The one ship I really, really hate. And there's an M. What is this guy over here? He's just sitting there. Is that an empty ship and he's gone inside, maybe? It does say pirate loot. Bogey, scanning. Fuck it, we'll blow it up. I don't know. Yeah, the big. Oh shit. No! Weapon system is offline. Landing gear. I keep deployed. doing that. Take off complete. Don't do Landing that. Complete. Take off complete. Landing gear raised. All right. Bogey scanning. Just tag back Shields. out a bit so I can actually see scanning. where the. Um, I mean, I still in the habit Shields of charging. obviously whenever I'm normally flying, I, we do a lot of racing, and I'm I'm constantly hitting double tapping the W key to speed up, and of course. That push you into full boost, and when you're this close to something, you don't want to double tap it, right? Because that's not going to be good. Shields. Four. And yeah, look, so you can do control. Um, so as Shields I said earlier, I, I ejected because I was um, I just did it out of instinct. But a control left here, we just just got out of our ship normally. All right, here we go. Comrade two seven five. Oh well, yeah, look, we're just outside. We're just outside this time, right? This is a 
point where some player comes along and I get blown up as a while I'm floating. But e the EVA is really good. Um, it's definitely much improved over running around in, um, you know, in free flight. Hang on, just in case. Because you never know, there might be someone in you. Stout man, 9000. Because you know what, that's definitely something you'd like to do, right? You just come to one of these arrays, hide your ship behind it somewhere, and just sit inside with a gun and just wait. You know, wait for someone to turn up, and you just do. You just um, summon your inner Nelson, and it's like, ah and shoot him in the face. So, I don't, if I, if I may ask, Luke, I mean, what what team are you? What part of the team are you with, Luke? If you don't mind me asking. Start up. Initiate. Just because I'm curious. Function restored. So, oh, that's what I did. I did wonder what that was. Well, now that you know how it's done, if you come across any more down to race, go ahead and reset them. So the reset. Only reach, if it's oh, safe. Though, once you're tangling with outlaws. It's a bit late. It's a bit late. Have you got work in the morning? <laughs> it's two. But yeah, I say it makes it even better. You know, you're in, you're one of the UK guys, and you're here at two a.m. just chilling, watching streamers. So there's a recharge station. Online. That's kind of cool. All right, let's go get our ship. And look, I can see the Hornet this time, look, I can see it, and there's no way I can lose it. There's no way I can lose it. Okay. I'm not sure how to holster my weapon. Not that it really matters, because when you get back in the ship, it um, puts it away. Just make sure I don't shoot a Hornet on the way back, because that would not be good. Most stable you've seen the game live. Yeah, it's the most stable I've had it. It's, we've been, you know, maybe five, ten minutes. Every five, ten minutes we've been bobbing out. But this is, we've been in over half an hour and I can't, I can't believe it. I'm just, I'm trying to do as much as I can before it bombs. And it's, it's, yeah. Alright. Jay is holster, okay. The thing is, we, we kind of, you know, ex expect them to crash down. I mean, obviously, you know, we're we're like, um, I don't know, you know, we're all backers of the game. I mean, I'm, I'm like a very heavy backer. I mean, I'm, I'm probably, I'm citizen number like 42,000 or something. I mean, back in right since the very beginning, very deep, deep into this game. And, um, you know, and I've, I've been playing and streaming it since since the hangar module came, appeared, and like a, over a year ago, I was sitting there hanging, hanging around in my hangar, just walking around and in my deluxe hangar, and... It's just so good to be at this stage, you know? We're at this stage now. And... Right, so that one there is the one I just came from. The Distress Beacon. So what we're going to do is we'll take... Um, let's take a different one. So basically what we're doing is we're turning on the, the com... Um, the communication arrays. So let's go to... Um, Let's go to one over here. Let's go to this one. No, let's get that one. Quantum travel initiated. The bombing fee is the Quantum travel complete. Well, if you're unproductive tomorrow, Bogey. I'll let you, I'll let you blame me. You got the situation Bogey, scanning. You know, scanning. You, you, you can blame me. If if you're unproductive tomorrow and you're Bogey. sleepy at death, just say, you know, you, you got stuck in someone's chat. 
I'll, I'll take the I'll take the heat. Oh, okay, okay. Each one will unlock a new mission at their probe. Okay, we'll do this one, and we'll go and unlock this one, and we'll go back to the probe. Boogie, boogie, scanning, scanning. I might have to actually shoot some soon. I mean, I was just ignoring them and letting the security take them out and just getting in and out. But if they start shooting at me, there's a 300 series we had to shoot because um, he started shooting me. The little bugger. Is it this? There it is, yeah. Not enough space sausage. Oh, status. Whoa, stop! I mean, I would imagine, as far as your question, Crash Box, I don't think, you know, obviously, I don't think Luke or any of those guys could, could they would really know at the moment. I think it's dependent on stability. That's the way I've, I'm, I'm seeing it, it's obviously. So, so we. That, that was good. We just crashed, but. That was what? That was at least. That was at least half an hour or so. That was, oh my god! That was that was re a really really smooth ride there. We actually, we we got we got two beacons unlocked. We got a mission. Damn! That that was a good run.